Hello everyone, my name is Korean. It is short for Korean Jinseng. And I am new here to this channel. So I want to share 5 facts about me you absolutely do not know. Number 1. I have acrophobia or the fear of heights. I never really knew this when I was young, as I thought it was a normal fear to have. Since it's a phobia, there is a bit of an abnormality to it. Like, uh, I can get scared from just standing on a normal sized chair. The fear is more prominent when I am on a ferris wheel, as they move slow and go up very high. I remember, uh, as a kid, even up to now, I'm even afraid of the kitty ferris wheels. I'm comfortable with roller coasters though as there is a thrill to them from the fast descent. So that's one fact about me, four to go. Number 2 I cannot eat crustaceans, be it shrimp or crab. I have a feeling I know how delicious they are just seeing as a lot of people around me enjoy them. But I just can't handle the taste. I don't understand. I remember I think I used to eat them very young, but I stopped and developed a hatred of their taste. Sounds a bit weird as I am from a place where seafood is very abundant, but I just prefer meat anyway. Number 3 I am a very short person. I'm only about 154 centimeters in height or about 5'1 or 5'2. It annoys me a lot since I can't reach a lot of things that are easily reached by taller people. The thing is, everyone in my family is short, and I am not the shortest member. I am like the third shortest out of us five, and the tallest is only about 160 centimeters or maybe about 5'5 five, five or 5'6 five, in height. It may be a genetic thing, but ever since I was young, I took height increasing supplements, drank milk, tried to sleep early, but still this is the height I can show for it. I'm already 24 years old, so I'm not expecting to grow any taller in the future. Number 4. Being a foreigner to maybe most of you, I am bilingual. I can speak two languages namely English and my country's language, Filipino, specifically the Tagalog dialect. I do believe I still need some improvement in both languages as I normally mix some words in sentences together. But as far as conversations go, I'm pretty decent. As of now, I am trying to learn a third language, Korean, and so far I am in the stage of learning how to read before learning the specific words. Hopefully some of you out there can help me in any language I need help in. Number 5 Lastly, I am an introvert. I'm very shy especially when it comes to new people and can barely hold a conversation with anyone. If we ever meet, you may have to keep bringing up topics until you find one I can talk about to get the conversation started. However, if you take too long to get a common ground, I might just have panicked and ran away from awkwardness. I'm usually terrible when I'm only with one person. Usually I need to be around at least two so they can talk and I'll just stand quietly in a corner or between them. I am trying to improve though. The internet helps. Memes help. I usually use comedy to keep things going. However, most of the time, my jokes are amiss, so it makes things more awkward. <laughs> oh god. Thank you guys so much for listening to me. Thank you guys so much for listening to me. I hope this is a new start for us to get to know each other. I hope you find me the least bit interesting for you to keep coming back here. Again, thank you so much and have a great day.